and got to read with Brie, and we did pretty much all the scenes from the film uh, with Destin, sort of like working with us, and remember like doing the best work of my life in that room and feeling like, oh, now I really want to be a part of this. And then it worked out, and I feel really lucky to have been chosen to be a part of this cast and to have sort of the responsibility of telling the story. You know, I realized inherently there's a part of me that represents this guy pretty fully. I'm from New York. Um, he feels like an Upper East Side. I, the only difference is I was Upper West Side. And it was like an Upper, upper East Side Jewish guy. Um, my dad was a, a, a worked in finance. This guy's a bit... So it's like I tried to really not overthink it and focus more on story. Their story that takes place in the 80s with David and, and, uh, and Jeanette is somewhat like the skeleton to the film and it it you know holds together all the flashback scenes and um, and I knew how important that was so I just tried to like really focus on story and listen to Destin and try to support Brie as much as I could it's a complicated movie I mean the book was complicated I remember reading the book and being like on I, I forgot early on and and shutting the the book and being like these are bad people um, and then like moving through that and just when you get to a place where you want to give up on them they do something so loving and and you and you know you you fall for them all over again and it sort of swings back and forth throughout the book and throughout the film in the same way and I think you know Woody and Naomi do such a beautiful job with that that you really don't know like like what you don't really know what the right thing to do is you know whether to, whether it is to turn your back on them or to really just embrace them and take the good from who they are and understand that they're your family and embrace that love